What is collateralization in DeFi? Imagine you want to borrow money, but the lender doesn't know or trust you. In traditional finance, you might put up your house as a guarantee. In DeFi, that guarantee is called collateralization. Collateralization means you lock up an asset you own, like TON, HTON, or another token. So a protocol will lend you funds in return. The locked asset is the lender's safety net. If you can't repay, the protocol can sell the collateral to cover the debt. Here's a simple example. You lock 100 ton as collateral and borrow a stablecoin. You still own that 100 ton on paper, but it's locked until you repay. You can use the borrowed stablecoin for trading, paying expenses, or other investments. DeFi prefers over-collateralization. That means you must lock more value than you borrow. So instead of borrowing $100 for $100 of collateral, you might need $150 in collateral to borrow $100. This protects the lender against price swings. A key concept in collateralization is LTV, loan to value. If your LTV rises too high because your collateral value drops or your loan balance increases, the protocol can liquidate part of your collateral to repay the debt. Liquidation is automatic and can be costly, so it's important to keep your LTV within a safe range. To stay safe, monitor your LTV, leave a buffer and don't borrow the maximum, diversify collateral when possible, and choose trusted platforms with clear liquidation rules. Some DeFi platforms accept liquid staking tokens, like HTON, so you can stake and still use value as collateral. That gives flexibility, but remember the same rules apply. Price moves can reduce your safety margin and increase the risk of liquidation. In short, collateralization is how DeFi lets you borrow without a credit check by locking assets as a guarantee. It's powerful, but it requires care. Know the LTV, expect margin calls or liquidation if prices fall, and only borrow what you can comfortably repay. Join the HIPPO community and be part of the number one most profitable liquid staking on time.